Hello folks, we're back home, we're in the UK, and we're going shopping with baby Frank, aren't we, Karen? Yes, hello. I've just seen that shower, look. What? What's the date? Look, Saturday the 20th of May, 2023. Look, energy bills to tumble. Our side's finally got some good news yesterday with energy bills set to drop by £450 a year within weeks. Well, mm. Sharon? Makes a change. Let's see what know, happens. Yeah. I bet it don't. So you've obviously really enjoyed our Ban uh, Benidorm videos and we, we had- enjoyed it as much as we did. <laughs> we had fun, Sharon, didn't we? we did. And uh, we're gonna be doing a few more travel vlogs. Obviously we're in the UK oh, at the moment. So yeah. next week we're going to Camden Town down in London. We'll take you down there and the roundabout area. We'll try some food and see what that's all about. But we're gonna be trying to throw them in for you more often now until we do go abroad again. We have got Greece later on in the year, shall we? October, it? Rhodes. Rhodes in Greece. Uh, you're definitely coming with us for that one. And uh, let's do a bit but of shopping. That time we're going all inclusive. Of course so we are. a bit different for us as well. Shall, let's do some shopping, baby. Spend some yeah. money. Because we've come home, shall, and there's no blink food in the house. <laughs> Jimmy and Charlotte have eaten ill. <laughs> yeah, I'll see if he spots the toys, shall. Look. Because we spotted them earlier. Look, some more here, look. Wow. Wow, what's that, Frank? So, look, shall, look, little swimming pool, look. Frank needs to go to bed at all, shall, doesn't he? He does. Right, so we've been inspired to try and create some tapas at home, so we're probably going to be doing that later on in the week. And we'll although, French stick. yeah, although people have said, shall, some people have said it's not authentic tapas. Well, tapas apparently has evolved, isn't it? And it's not yeah. just a little bar used, a little bowls used to get a peanuts and olives and stuff. They've uh, tapas alley is full of this sort of stuff, so we're going to go along with that type. You're just going to get a French loaf there, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, French loaf for Spanish, yeah. <laughs> no, no, salt and, salt pepper, and pepper baguette. We're going to go for that. Go one. on in, have that. So quite a few people have said that the um, the paella we had was overcooked and burnt. Then some people have said no, that's authentic because they've used the squid ink to darken it up. So we don't know. It was a very pungent smell though, but um, uh, a taste rather, and it, it was actually quite tasty. Very tasty if you do like fish. Oh, I've nearly tripped over that sign here. Look. So um, we're going to have a go using. Uh, saffron to lighten the colour of the rice because apparently the yellow colour is supposed to be reminiscent of the Spanish flag so we were told as well we don't know we'll have to do a bit of Google research on that but um, anyway carry on you're on the juice Frank hey you're on the juice <laughs> where you go what are you doing you're on the juice he don't hold it anymore shall look <laughs> it's hands free <laughs> Hands free juice shell. These are handy, folks. Look, uh, 85 pence. They're mini wraps, basically. They're only small. Look at the size of my hand. Look, but you can use them as a pizza base. Put some tomato paste over the top, cheese, tomato, anything on there, onions. Make yourself some little little pizzas. He does love a raspberry, does baby Frank show, doesn't he? Don't yeah, you, baby Frank? Fruit, Frank, do you love a raspberry? Do you love a raspberry? So you are a raspberry, Of course he is. A lot of people ask, show, what is that thing you've got in your hand? Scanner. Yeah, so basically all you do, folks, you scan the uh, barcode on the item. It comes up there, and it also totals it up as well at the same time. And then you put it straight in your bag. So then, afterwards, you take this to the till show, don't you? Yeah and plug that into a machine it reads what's on there and then you pay so that means you're, you're basically bagging everything up as you go and that saves you doing it when you reach the checkout and it you're also already packed. you're already packed that's right so you're packing as you go along yeah so we use tesco again for that one of that reasons as well it stops queuing for the tills and stuff although you do get a queue little queue for the machine but uh, it does speed things up with the packing away and stuff so anyway onwards we get some olives baby not olives um Avocados. We do eat quite a few avocados. Never used to, acquired taste, but uh, we like it. And they're full of the good oil, Sharon. They sure are. Always have a look at the uh, reduced section, folks. Sometimes you can find some good deals here. And sometimes you can't. And sometimes you can't, Sharon. <laughs> Sit down, Frank. Sit down, baby Frank. Why is that strap him in, shall? 
Little monkey, isn't he? What are you doing, Frank? Wow. Well, here we are. You do like a sausage, Sharon, wow. don't you? Wow. Hey? Yeah. Look, Sharon, tends to like a cheap sausage, folks. Wow. Don't you, baby? Wow. You like a sausage, Frank? He likes a sausage, hey? yeah, he does. Oh, sure, we can't leave this section without getting a black pudding, baby. Got to have that on a fry up. We're going to have a weekly fry up, baby. There you go. I hated that, folks. And I think you did, Sharon, didn't you? No, Look. I used to have it. Mum used to cook it with me when I was little for breakfast. Oh, I never liked it, folks. It's made just pig's blood and all that. But I tell you what, I love it now. Oh, reduced the clear again, Sharon. What have you got there? No, I'll do my own flavouring, I mean. Yeah, well, we do, don't we? We've got all the gear. What's them burgers, though? There we go. From five pound, what's that? A quid off? How many is in there? They're normally about ninety two. pence a burger. Fifty one, one fifty two, two fifty, three, three fifty four, four fifty five. Now you're not really any cheaper there, is it? You can get a proper full size one for uh, ninety pence in um, a butcher's, and I'd much prefer a butcher's uh, burger, chef. Yes. Jelly deals. Yes. Right, Sharon. Here we are. Look. Now we're at the seafood section. Yes. Now. Again, they're going to be. Oh, they're pretty cheap, aren't they? Two nineteen. Yeah. Is that all right? King prawns. Yeah, look. We'll have a go at that for our little tapas, Sharon. Try that. See if you scan it, folks. Show us the scan, Sharon. Yeah? Oh, two fifty nine. Actually, it wants two nineteen. What is that? A price match price. Oh, I don't know. What's that's that then? Two. Have I got a different one? You got the king. Oh, guess all right. We don't mind the king prawns. Better than the smaller ones, aren't they? So we'll have them. Chow, what about a bit of pate, maybe? Okay. It's only cheap, isn't it? You get a dear one, we get a if we get the um that's a smooth one, or you've got the uh the textured one which is the smooth. You want the smooth? No, that's that's smooth as well. Oh is it? The smooth, oh okay, yeah. Okay, fine. Right, we we'll get one of them folks, 69 pence, you can't go wrong at that. Oh you've got to scan it, aren't you? Sorry. So we've hit the cheese section, we've got a couple of, what you got Sharon? Mozzarella and brie at the moment. Right, okay, well that'll do for the moment. Uh, what have you got there, Sharon? No. What's that? Mozzarella and slow roasted tomatoes. Very nice baby, Frank. No. Yes? Do you like them? Yeah? Of course he does. Have you scanned it, Sharon? Right, put that in there. And some lovely massive olives. These are pitted ones, folks, which means they haven't got the um, pips in, <laughs> so to speak. And they're stuffed with garlic, very nice. Shell, you're going to become a tapas queen. Oh, I like tapas, I'm quite happy with that. Of course you are. So we're just looking at the different types of hams you've got here, folks. We could put bacon on, but um, it's more authentic with um, a bit of the thinly sliced uh, prosciutto. What is that one, Shell? Prosciutto, it's pancetta. Oh, is it? bread, doesn't it? I don't know. With the cheese and tomato, like Of course it is, Sharon. Here. Whack that, you've got to scan it, baby. Here we are, and all you do is you scan your barcode with that with your tool, and it transfers all the information in there. And then we spent £111 a day, and she's got a savings of £7.93. Scan your barcode. What's that barcode you got there, Chef? 10% off. 10% off. And that's basically it. So you've got eight. What's that? That takes it down to £100. £100. There you go. We've got a savings of £18. That's because we're regular shoppers. Well, and, no, because I've got the club card. And you've got the club card thing, yeah. And I pay seven ninety nine a month for that. Well done. But you get lots of offers. That's if you use it. Use it or lose it. Hello, what's Frank doing, Shell? He's having a go at my sandwich, look. That's Granddad's darling. Yeah, put it in there. Put it over there. Good boy. And then all you do then is you pay. I won't show you putting a pin in. No, please don't. <laughs> He's got it again, Shell. Look. What you got? That's Granddad's, yes. Chicken. Oh, that's Nanny. Sorry, she's gone all blink. Look, she's got the chorizo one. Look, well done. Leave it in there, Frank. No, I shot with my eyes. Hey? I shot with my eyes, and that looked the nicest. That looked the nicest. Yeah. Right, that's it. Right, that's our shopping for another week, folks. Yeah. And there you go. Right, we'll make our way out to the car. And I can honestly say it's no dearer than Lidl. Here. No. And I've checked about the same amount. Yeah. And you've got more choice. Yeah. So there you go. That's what we've done, folks. That's how we do our shopping of a week. <laughs> Happy days. You went like that with that noise. It doesn't. I know. I see his face. Didn't you like that noise, Frank? Well, it is 
early in the morning, folks. That's all I'm going to say about that one. And we're on manoeuvres. We're going to an auction in Grimsby. I've got him to take me. Look. Who's him? You. You, him. I told him to be here. Don't start. Here we go. Hold on. Right, you watch I, my video because I, I've got the proof. I told him to be here. Well, I said... No, he on. said. He said, "What time?" Hang right, on. Listen. Hang on. Can I just talk to my wait people? No. Wait a minute. Hold on. No. I'll no. let you out. Hang on. I'll stop the stop the van. I'll stop. We stop, won't go the there. The road. We won't go there. Oh, see what mood he's in this morning, folks. <laughs> it's, it's, and people say started, he picks on me. He started it. People say, "Oh, he picks on." I pick on him. He's picking on me. He started. I said it. to him, what, "What time in the morning?" This was yesterday. He said, uh, "What about seven o'clock?" I said, "No, make it half seven. And he said, "Well, I thought you wanted to get there early." I said, we met in the middle at quarter past seven. Never. Quarter past seven, he's not there, is he? He's Never. not turned up, has he? Never. And he, I phoned him up and he said, you said half seven. I said, no, he didn't. Anyway, he come round. He did half I said, he come round, uh, 28 minutes past seven. And I said, hold on a minute. You now said half past seven, it's too early. Is he ever dead he is? Oh, well, I love that word. <laughs> so I made him a cup of coffee. And I said, wait there, pull your car in the drive. Yeah, yeah. Wait there, I'll make a cup of coffee. So I said to, I said to Sharon, I said, 20 he's, minutes. he's here. I said, he's here. And she said, uh, oh, he's here, is he? I said, yeah. I said, I'm making a cup of coffee. Take him away a cup of coffee. And as I'm making it, he's, bibbing, he's bloody all in the drive, and he bib, bib, bib. I went, I went. Baby Frank's I, upstairs I, asleep. I went, beep, beep, because Sharon waved. You only need one bib, mate, to make the point. You only need to say it once. Anyway, after all that, we've got two travel coffees here. Well, I've got a travel tea, actually. One's bigger than the other. Yeah, well, I'll give you the big one, because you're bigger than me. Oh, thank you. And uh, we're on our way to Grimsby to the auction house. You said that. I'm after a couple of things. I'm summing up now. Yeah, but I told them. I'm summing I, up. I wouldn't tell them what you're getting. Well, because I know it's not video. coming out now. That's your video. It's coming out later. Can we shut up? <laughs> he, he's making me aggressive, folks. He's always aggressive. This is the bit you don't you normally don't see. You don't see him. <laughs> oh, you're. Oh, you're. That's going to be oh, cut. Oh, you're. Oh, hello. Bumper on the side of the road. <laughs> Pheasant. Someone's going to say, two heads on the wheel. Anyway, <laughs> see you in a minute. Shut up! Okay, folks, we've got ourselves here now. We're a bit early, which is nice, because I haven't had a look around. I've only seen the stuff online. So let's get him a ticket. All right, what are we going for here? He's moaning about the, the coffee I've done. It's too strong for him, folks. So two to four hours, that's 2.50. Uh, they take two pound coins. Yeah, it does. So over four hours. So three, if I put three pound in, enter your reg number. What is it? Nine. One, 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 one. It's just numbers, I think. Yeah, this coffee's better if you shake it. Eh? Hey? This oh. coffee's better if you shake it. Hold on, hello. Can't get a coin in there. Coin. No, there's no card there. The coin's not going in. No, it ain't. I don't know if it's working or not. Oh, what's this here? Park, park and pay. Using pay by phone? Oh, yeah. Oh, is that what it's all yeah. about now? I've got the app. Yeah. Can you do it? I'll, I'll give you the money. Yeah. Three pounds. Yeah. That annoys me, that, folks. All this bleeding park Remind and pay on your phone. Me. Not everyone does that. I don't do banking on my phone. Eh? Hey? Remind me not to take the key out of the ignition. Don't take the key out of the ignition. Right. Here, that's your three pounds. That's pay, pay for all day, look. Oh, I don't want your money. I hey? Oh, I'll get it back then. Put it away. <laughs> <laughs> eh? I said I'll put petrol in here, say. Hang on, where are we going? Eh? Well, we're here. Right, what's it, what's it called? Car park? Yeah, no, the... the, the Do you have to tell them what the car park is? Yeah, we've got a code. Oh, what's all this here, look? Location, look. 807644. That's the location. I much prefer putting money in a machine, folks, like that. Is it not like working, that. then, the machine? Eh? No, the machine's not working. Right, I'm just going for the car. Just cut here, folks. While we're trying to sit here, right? While we're just trying to sit here getting the, the app on the phone and getting it to process, a bloke just walks up, he's put money in the machine, he's walked off with his ticket. <laughs> What's going on there? Oh, he, he, <laughs> he did it, I heard the money going. I know. But I tried a two pound yeah. coin, it says it takes two pound coins. <laughs> oh, what a bloody. Oh. If it around you, you're bleeding Jonah. You, you might, know that. You might have to do it, because this is not processed. Oh, don't yet. say that. Thank you, Tom. Oh, look what he's dropped, folks. Look, he's dropped his brute, look. Oh, give me my brute. Put that away. Go on. Oh, hello. Don't do that. I've only got two pound coins. I'm going to try it again. Hold on. No, hang on. Don't do it when I'm processing. 
Well, well you should you should have gone through by now, surely. Well, it should have been charged me double. Well, I'll charge a double because I'll be paying for the other lot. That should have gone through by now, surely. You it right. I know exactly what I've done. It said processing. That's the word that it uses when it's doing something. I know that, but did you do it right at the start? Yes. You know what you like. <sighs> Honestly, folks, technology. I got pound coins, but it didn't take the two pound coins. Look, it won't go in. Look. No, I just I got two of them. It won't go in. So it's not me. It does say it takes two. Look, there, two pound coins accepted. Look. Oh, I'll do it again. We're not even in there. But here, the auction would have bloody finished the time we get in there. I can't even get out of this now. Have you got a signal? Listen, it's nearly nine o'clock. The auction starts at half nine. I don't expect it to be it, eh? It's nothing to do with us being late. It's because your tickle tackle won't work. Tickle tackle? <laughs> you, you, you ain't got the coins, mate. Do you want to try my coins? You ain't got any coins, have you? You got pound coins? They probably work with pound coins. See you in a minute, folks. This is doing my Sweden. <sighs> At last, that's taken us about ten minutes. What's the time now? Hold on. Three more times we tried to do it, folks. He had the wrong card details in. We've had to put his other credit card details in. Unbelievable. Honestly, everything around him gives me stress sometimes. No, he said, he said look, the old car park, look at this, look. Right, just show you around the car park, folks, look. How empty is all that, look, yeah? Look, all that. Look where he wants to park, look. In between two cars, look. Unbelievable. Anyway, let's get inside. You've left your window open. See what I mean, look. He's left his window out. He's going to get out of the car, look. He's left the bloody window open, look. Come here. Come on, hurry up. Look, he's fiddling about, look. Fiddling about. This is what I've had to put up with. Come yeah, come out. Get out of the car. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, look. As if we've got a minute to waste, look. He's still fiddling about, look. I'm just leaving it running for. He don't need his coat, he's going inside, look. Come on! Here, yeah, come here. Come here. What do you want now? I want to show you something. I want to show you something. What? Right. Just look at a vast car park here, all the empty spaces, and look where you wanted to park between two cars, look. What's that all about? Safety in numbers. Let's go inside. Right folks, this is what I'm here for. This little record deck here is a blinking beauty. It's the old Mark 7, 12, 10 Technics. Which is what I'm looking at folks. That's what I'm looking at folks. So that's what I'm bidding on. That's my main three reason I'm here today. 
different little look here as well. The old vintage um, Technic stuff is uh, coming back in, so I might have a little go at this as well. And also, this old uh, stereo graphic equaliser. I'm having a look at that as well. But there's loads of different stuff here today, folks. And what we've got here. This is Denon and Kenwood stuff. It's okay, but uh, we'll see what that goes for as well. There you go, that's what I'm here for. I'll have a little look around so you can see what else is here. Lots of new clothing here as well. And also some uh, sliders, new shoes. Look at this, look. Let's have a little look what's in here. No. Nah. All brand new, but it's not really a design I want to get involved with. These can be worth a few, Bob. These older DAB radios. Might have a little go on that. God, look at them, look, they're all tandy. You remember that? The old record uh, tape decks. There's three of them there. Although that one's missing its handle by the looks of it. You can get all sorts here. Fridges, TV, monitors. All good prices. So it's well, finally in, folks, aren't we? Eventually. And you're, you're not bidding on what I'm bidding on. Keep away. I might do. Yeah, keep away. Hey, look, you want a monitor. Look, for your, for your van, that's what you want. No, I've got, I've, got, I've got a monitor, haven't I? Yeah, go through the backs, have a look through the backs. Hey, look right here. Hey? Go through the back. There you go. Any time of day. I want to get a pen actually. I don't want to write down some of the stuff. I haven't, see, because we were rushing, I haven't got a pen. I want yeah, to write well, down. If you were on time, mate. Well, I was, wasn't I? Let's look through here. Good old selection here. That's the actual welder I've got. That's a nice little tool. Oh. Here for this lot though, this is a lot later. Yeah, so I just saw you. Hey, eh? what's that? Look, what we found <laughs> <laughs> unbelievable. No, no. Martin, yeah, having a rap. Yeah, all right. Might have a child, folks. I want to get a pen, let's get a pen from somewhere. I want to write down the numbers and stuff. Oh, you suppose I've got one in the van? Let's go back out to the van. <laughs> Just know it's someone else looking at it, folks. I might have a bit of competition here, so I'll do what I'll be having a whistle about it. Someone's just pulled that deck out and had a look at it. Anyway, see you in a minute. Hello. Hello. <laughs> so we've got about five minutes to go, folks, and so we're just at the front here. And uh, hopefully we'll get what we want. Well, you're not bidding on anything anyway, are you? Unless I like something. Of course you ain't, but you're not, you ain't got a bidding well, it's number. Like up, isn't it? You don't have a bidding number. Oh, have you? Yeah, you ain't got one, have you? Oh, there's one. You can't, you, you, can you, can't, you can't play today, folks. Yeah, you can anyway. Two, lot number 101, pair of binoculars, starting yeah. three pounds, three pounds for the binoculars, three pounds anywhere, anyone interested in binoculars for three pounds, yeah. their ones are not sold, yeah. lot number one zero. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, okay, three, two, five, zero. Look, if I do look like I'm going to miss you bid, just give me a shout, lot number one zero two, basket of assorted, a uh, bit of everything in this one, we'll start with three pounds. Three pounds for all this lot. Three pounds for this basket full of stuff. Three pounds anywhere. Come on, somebody. Three pounds anywhere. Anyone interested in this one? Just three pounds, though. That one's not sold. Lot number uh, one zero three is a box of DVDs. Start me three pounds. Three pounds for the DVDs. Three pounds anywhere. Anyone interested? Three and bid four anywhere. Four pounds anywhere. Selling away at three pounds. Three pounds to number. 
Hang up number 104. Here's a box of vintage tins, nice quality straight tins and things. And I've got seven pounds bid. <coughs> seven bid eight anywhere. Eight pounds anywhere. Selling them at seven pounds. Lot number 105 is a basket of motorbikes. Uh, someone start me uh, three pounds on these. Yeah. Three and bid four anywhere. Four pounds anywhere on these. Four anywhere. Selling them at three pounds. Pounds to number 2472. Lot number 116 is a vintage radio, and I'm straight in at 22 pounds bid. 22 pound bid, 24 anywhere. 24 pounds anywhere. 24 and I'm out. 24 bid, 26 anywhere. 26 anywhere. Selling away then. 24 pounds to number nine. Number nine. Thank you, sir. Lot number 117 is a vintage fan, and I've got four pounds bid. Four bid, five anywhere. Five pounds anywhere on this one. Five, six. Six for me, seven anywhere. Seven pounds anywhere. Selling away then at six pounds. Six pounds. Lot number 344 is the Technic Stereo Tuner. Uh, and I'm straight in at 18 pounds bid. 18 pound bid, 20 anywhere. 20 pounds anywhere on this one. Selling away then at eight at 20. And I'm out. 20 pounds bid, 22 anywhere. £22 anywhere, selling away then at £20, £20 to number 1587 and lot number uh, 345 is the Technics double cassette deck, apparently cassettes are getting popular again, 26 on bid, 26 bid, 28 anywhere, 28, 30 and 2, I'm out, 32 bid, 34 anywhere, £34 anywhere, selling away then at £32, £32 to the same buyer and lot number 346 is the Technics Integrated Amplifier and I'm straight in at £46 bid, 46 48 50 and 2 and out, 52 bid, 54 anyway, £54 anyway, so in a way that £52, £52 to number 10 56 uh, lot number 347, two kitchen items, five on bid, six anywhere. Six pounds anywhere, six on bid, seven anywhere. Seven pounds anywhere, seven at six pounds. Three, two, one, three. Lot number uh, 348. 348 is the Technics turntable in the box. What a cracking piece of equipment this is. I have got bids all over the place for this. My lowest is 42. What do we go next? 100, 160, 220, 250, 260 pound we are bid. 260 pound bid, 270 anywhere. 270, 280, 290, 300, 310, 330, and I'm 330, 340, and I'm out. 350, 360, 380, 390, 400, 400 pounds on bid, 410 anywhere, 410 pounds anywhere on this one, fair warning, selling away then at 400 pounds, 400 pounds to number, is it? Do you know what I won? No. I won nothing. <laughs> They'd Unbelievable. Dollar, dollar. I was going for 300 pounds there folks as you can see on the bottom one. The other items I was going to bid on again I was outbid. I wasn't going to push myself over the budget. Very easy to do that and I could have done easy. But uh, I was going for 300 pounds on the uh, 210. It went for 400 plus commission. You got about 15% commission on each. So it's 60 quid commission on top of that. So 460 pounds. You can get them on uh, eBay for that sort of price. Oh well. So, oh, yeah, hello. Oh well, that's what I'd say. He come out and had a kip, folks. Look. Oh well, it was worth coming because I knew there'd be a lot of interest in it. But uh, time to say to eat. Then let's go to recovery. Let's treat you to recovery. I thought you might have gone for some of the other techniques. I don't. I didn't. I, I was. I had them the all down there. Were good. I had them all down there, but I'm not going to go and do it for the sake of doing it. You're right because you have to have a limit. I've got my limit, and you're my limit right at this moment. What have I done now? He's just told me that he'd left the lights on. It's not starting. Try it again. I don't think it will. You're a bloody jinx, do you know that? I am. 
I'm a genius. Unbelievable. Well, you're going to have to sort this one out. Nothing to do with me. He's got a jump pack, folks, and I've told him about it to bring it. Where's your jump pack? I'll go to He gave it to his brother. He's left the lights on. Now we're stuck in Grimsby. So how come you put the lights on? What? How come your lights was on? Because I leant over. What, when you come out? To, to, to open the window and then shut the window and I must have left the lights on. He's right, folks. Everything around him is goes wrong. Things go wrong. This is why I get the ump. Oh, well, look at We just found someone with some jump leads, look. Oh, unbel he? unbelievable. He come out about a hundred numbers ago to have a little kip in the car and as he's leant over to open the window he's knocked the light switch on <sighs> now you need someone to jump it off it's coming it's coming you got lucky there no oh yeah my name's lucky lee unbelievable I got a thing on it, <laughs> <laughs> unbelievable you got blinking lucky there mate video, you know <laughs> hey, all right I can't see what's what here. Right, positive is positive, negative is negative. What a saga. Don't you short them out. Shut up. Shut up? You're aggressive. I'm not. <laughs> I'm a fucking nutter. <laughs> Unbelievable, you are. It's a nice bear, but it works. Of course it is. There's that one. Put that one on I'll give you that. Alright. Who's the old I'm not holding it. <laughs> sure, mate. Right, let's go get the. Uh... Get in your car. Hang on. Make sure your lights are off this time, will you? Shut up, you. Look, this is good for your channel, isn't it? Unbelievable. Make sure you're not in gear. Make sure you're not in gear. It's an auto. Hold on. Go on. Hold on, wait, that might be the negative, mightn't it? Right Try it now. No, hold on. Stay there. Hey, right. eh? it's just a connection problem. Try that. Strange, isn't it? Try that. Nearly. Very near, isn't it? One minute. Hold on, wait. It's right now. Yeah. Go on then. Just show rev your vehicle up a little bit. Right. Try it now. Try right now. Was that hot? Same you've got nothing to hold it on with it like wedge it on with that or something. Hold it on with that. Do that Rather than burn your finger. You know? That might might help it, mightn't it? Tell us when you're on there. Wait there. Wait there. You on? No. Try it now. So I'll try and just accelerate your accelerate a little bit. No, because that's getting up. It is getting up, is it? Yeah. I thought that would have done it then with that pushed on there with the old uh You in it? Yeah, he's in it. Right, turn your key all the way. Take it off. Take it off. Try it right now. No. <laughs> you ain't got no lights on or anything, have you? No. Try it right now. That one's smoking and all. Try right now. The one. Nice one, cheers, mate. Anyway. Because I can keep him quiet now. Keep... See? I said rev it. I know I'm that. Not daft. You are daft. You should have done it in the first well, place. Well, I don't do it. I know, right. Anyway, let's get on to the carvery. Right, we've just pulled up, folks. We're at the uh, carvery now. This is called the Trawlerman. And it's in Cleethorpes. Nice little place. We've had me and Sharon have had many carveries here. And not many people here at the moment. It's just before 12 o'clock. I'm hoping it is open. 
Better check the sign actually. It's open. In we go, I want to go to the toilet first, so I'm going to find the toilets. In you go. Unbelievable. Judas. Pulled it off. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you've had the fat. Oh, you've had the fat, yeah. That's the best bit. Put the flavour in. Of course it is. Well, posh ham. Posh ham, yeah. So what have we got here? What, can't you see? No. You've got oh, three lots of meat there. One chicken. Turkey. 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 So you did that. Of course I did. You get everything. Two. Uh, yes, please. Do you get little sausages still? Do you, do you, do you do that anymore? Yeah, you have to pay extra for the oh, you never used to, did you? It's inflation, mate. A lot of people changed everything now. Yeah, they? oh well, never mind. There you go, fella. Cheers, buddy. You're welcome. Hey, mate. Hello. Sprinkle Hello. them. You want beef as well, yeah? I like to put yeah. them in there, I don't like that. Oh, there was no turkey beef. Turkey beef? Well, that's not what I had then, was it? Uh, I turkey beef. Yeah. Alright, let's put that there. Put a few carrots on there. Go. A bit of that in there. This is what I like, the old ma cauliflower cheese, but I do love a bit of that. Look. And I've gone large, by the way, folks. You can always come back as well. Let's get that sauce down at the bottom. Hey, look, get that sauce on there, look. I'm not a big fan of red cabbage, so I won't be having none of that. But I do like a lovely bit of mash. So I'm going to whack a bit of that on there. Only a little bit, folks. Look. Only a little bit. <laughs> and I'll also have some um, lovely dark potatoes. Stick them around there, look. And don't forget, you can come back up, folks. But uh, if you've got a big plate, you might as well fill it. In my eyes. Although Sharon don't. Sharon don't fill the big plate. Now I'll pull them on there, but I probably won't eat them. And over to the gravy station, and I'm quite partial to some horseradish. Over there, look. I like to put plenty of that on. One more go. They uh, they used to do the, the English mustard in a in the bowl as well, but not this time. And they got some nice gravy. Fill that Yorkshire up and over there. And there doesn't appear to be any greens here for a change. I do like some greens, you see, but uh, you don't eat a lot of greens. You got enough there? Well, you you got more than me. <laughs> I've got some. Look, all shredded. Oh, I've got loads of that. All right, let's get over there, folks. Thanks for taking me to uh, Grimsby today. Thank you for that. All right. Thanks for breaking down. It's all right. Thanks for co co cocking up their uh, satellite dish to right. Facebook so they can't broadcast live. Sorry I bought you the deck for you. But what? Sorry I bought the deck. <laughs> <laughs> there you go folks. It is greedy but uh, this will be all I have to eat today. I've heard that before. So let's have a bit of, <laughs> bit of black pepper on there. I do like my black pepper. Oh, you do. And someone did complain or suggest that I have too much salt, or well, I did have too much salt on that fish and chips. Well, here we are, folks. I didn't actually know it was going to come out that fast, folks, but look, that's the normal well, amount well, of salt I have. We? We're in the Trollerman. The Trollerman. In uh, Grimsby. At Grimsby. Yeah. And uh, he's got that. Must wrap, must I'm going to tuck in, folks. It all looks nice, mate. Flour cheese is superb. That all Spanish has got a right good kick to it. Let's just try these roast potatoes. I'm going in with a whole one. Well cooked on the outside and as I say the cauliflower cheese is my favourite. Lovely. And everything is hot.
not, folks. Yeah, mine won't be. <laughs> Keep holding this camera. Right. <laughs> All right. Here you go. Go on. Thank you. It's lovely. Beach nice. What potatoes like? They're all right. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, a bit crispy and not bad on the inside. Yeah. It's all right for nothing, isn't it? Well, yeah, it's always better when there's nothing. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. So I'm going to go 10 pounds of that geezer. Right, we're going to eat this and we'll see you and give our verdict at the end. See you in a minute. What did you think of that? No? No. no. Why is that then? They seem, I've, I've had a lot of cars and they're very bland these days. The only best bit is the meat. Have you considered it might be your taste buds? No. Because I've eaten all mine. Yeah. And mm. although I understand what you're saying, they're not as good as they used to be. No. But it was filling. It was value for money. Don't All the food it. was hot, and I enjoyed it. Yeah, well, I'll, I'll, I'll give it. A, I'll give it a six. I'd probably go to a seven. Well, all right, I'll give it a five actually. Well, you should said a six. Well, seven's not very high. Seven's average. Is it? No, yeah, I'll go to probably a seven. It's an average one. Well, I enjoyed it, folks. It was a lot of food. And would we come back? Yeah, I probably would. I wouldn't. You won't be invited. I said if I had to come back on my own stream, I wouldn't have this. No, well, that's you, isn't it? I would have preferred the breakfast. Well, you can't live a life eating breakfast all the time. No, it's true. But if the food's good, then you don't have to worry. So he's putting me on a downer now, folks. How can I put you on a downer when I'm telling you the truth? I'll tell you for why. Because you're bugging up the, 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 the cash machine. I didn't bugger it up. The auction, you made me lose everything. Oh, but it was my fault, was and it? And when we got outside, oh. you had a flat battery. So it's my fault. So it is, yeah. Oh, well. Back outside, folks. He wants an ice cream on the seafront. Let's just hope this thing starts. Go on, see if it starts. Before we go any further. Told you, didn't I? Hey? In we get, folks. In we get, folks.